Illumifier here. Today I'm going to show you how to keep players from being able to drop items from their inventory. Now you might ask why would you want to do that? And the reason for this is because certain adventure maps require specific items in order to progress through and beat the game. And if players were to accidentally drop these items off of a cliff or into lava with no hope of getting them back, then they wouldn't be able to do so. And that's the case with my adventure map. I, I'm creating a Link to the Past adventure map, as you can tell from my skin that I created. And I was worried that players would accidentally drop the Master Sword or a key or the Titan's Mitt. And then they wouldn't be able to beat the game or get to the next area. And so I created a system that would keep players from being able to drop items so that their inventory is the is secure. They can obviously get items, but they won't be able to ever lose them. The first thing we're going to do is give ourselves a command block. We're going to set two command blocks next to each other and then set another two on top of those ones. We're going to set the first command blocks to always active on repeat and the top command blocks we're going to set to chain, conditional, and always active. Chain, conditional, always active. Good. Now we'll need the first command. I have them saved here for convenience. And let me grab that and put it here. Now let me tell you what this command does. This command tests for all entities or items with an age of zero. Now when an item leaves your inventory or, or is summoned into the world for the first time, it gets an age counter attached to it. And the age counter starts at zero. So when you drop an item, obviously, the age will be zero and this command block will find it. This leads us to our next command. This command finds this item and sets its pickup delay to zero. Now let me explain what that means. We're going to turn this off for now and when I drop this item, you know how it takes a second to pick items back up? This command block sets the pickup delay to zero so that when you try to drop it, it's being picked back up immediately. And you can't ever get rid of the item because it's being picked up faster than you can get away from it. Now there is a problem with this. For some reason, and I'm not entirely sure why, when you get rid of the item by dragging it out of your inventory, it still leaves. And I did some investigating and I figured out that it's because it has a it has a different age when it's dragged out than if it was dropped using Q. And after messing around with it, I figured that age was 4,800. Don't ask me why, but it is. So we're going to do the same thing we did with the first command blocks. We're going to test for an item with an age of 4,801. The one is there just to make sure that I don't miss the item. And then we're going to uh, use the same command to set its pickup delay back to zero. So again, can't drop it with Q. Now I can't drop the item by trying to drag it out. There is one flaw to this that I found. And if you're falling, you're falling fast enough to where the item can leave your inventory before it's picked up again. And that's the only way to get rid of it, get rid of an item. And I don't think it will affect very many people. I don't expect very many adventure maps to have, have long falling distances where players could lose items. And I don't expect people to really be trying to drop items while they're falling anyways. But I just thought I would mention that limitation just so you you all are aware. Now there is one more thing that I want to bring up that I forgot to mention. 
and that's when you die you're going to lose their inventory obviously but if you want to keep your items and not be able to get rid of them through dying or through dropping you're going to have to change a game rule for that now i'm sure many of you already know this it's pretty common knowledge but for the, those that don't you're going to type in game rule and it will be you'll type in game rule keep inventory and set that to true so now with both the game rule and my command block method you have a true system of never being able to uh, lose an item from your inventory except for that small flaw that I pointed out earlier while falling there we go well there you have it with only four simple command blocks we can effectively make a system to keep players from being able to drop items. If you liked my tutorial, please like and subscribe to my channel for more content that is sure to come. And as always, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.